Welcome back, fearless crafters. It is a Monday, and guess what? It is Star Wars Day. That's right, May 4th is Star Wars Day, and I'm just so excited. I love Star Wars. Um, I actually have a Star Wars koozie with me. So excited, Darth Vader. I got this at a Minnesota Twins game. Best game ever. There was Stormtroopers, there was Darth Vader, there was Wookiees, there, everybody everywhere. Awesome. So today we're gonna make lightsaber stringer. I am so excited, you guys, you have no idea. I also wanna give a shout out to my best friend, Chelsea. Uh, four years ago, before I got married, she threw me a Star Wars wedding shower. <laughs> it was so much fun. There was lightsaber pretzels. There was like a green drink that had something to do with Yoda. There was all kinds of stuff. She went all out for it. It was amazing. So Chelsea, this video is for you. Right, guys here we go with our lightsaber string art for Star Wars Day. I'm going to start with gray crochet thread on the handles of all three lightsabers. Uh, first I'm using an 8 inch by 11 inch pine board. I've painted it black with acrylic paint and then I spattered some white on it to give it the look of distant stars in the galaxy because that's where our lightsabers are. Uh, so again, I'm using gray crochet thread for the handles and I'll do all three first so that I don't have to change colors right away. All right, now that we're done with the handles, we're gonna start on the actual blade of the lightsaber. I'm using embroidery floss for, these, um, for this part of the string art because uh, it's actually thicker than the crochet thread. It's four tiny little threads all kind of combined into one. Um, so it's gonna cover the blade more efficiently. Also, uh, these were the closest colors I had to the colors of the lightsabers that I wanted. So I'm going to start with blue and then green and then I'm going to do red. Um, also, I was reading about lightsabers uh, on gizmodo.com so I want to share a couple of things with you. Uh, they were essentially created by the dark side. The first proto lightsaber was called a force saber and was essentially dark side energy channeled into a blade via crystals and alchemy. If a Jedi picked up a force saber or he or she she, he or she would run the risk of immediately and unwillingly turning to the dark side simply by using it. The early Jedi made the first lightsabers in order to use these weapons without becoming evil. So let's talk about colors really quickly. A lightsaber blade's color is determined by the crystal it uses to focus the energy. 
Jedi and Sith alike could and did wield any color blade. The Sith got in the habit of using red, um, but both used red for a time. Jedi fell into the habit of exclusively using blue and green when they started using the natural crystals of the planet Ilum to make their blades, where green and blue were the only naturally occurring colors. So when they first started out, red could be used by both sides, but eventually it became the well-known mark of the dark side. So I thought those were pretty interesting and I wanted to share that with you guys. So we're just going to continue to finish coloring the, in the blades of the lightsabers. Uh, I've done blue and green and now we're going to do red because you have to have a little bit of darkness with all of your light in your life. Or so I'm told. <laughs> Now I'm just finishing up the red lightsaber and what I'm going to do after this is I'm going to go back around the outlines of the handles of all three lightsabers with black crochet thread. There's a little bit of embellishment that I really want to accentuate and black is the best way to do it. So we'll just do that and then we'll be done. Get that hair fixed right okay there you have it guys we have lightsaber string art for our rooms so exciting I hope you enjoyed this project as much as I did and may you always celebrate May the 4th be so <laughs> I'm such a geek I love Star Wars it's so fun um, also I had a baby shower that was Star Wars themed my husband reminded me of that so I recommend Star Wars theme for your wedding showers your baby showers your birthday parties if you just want to have a fun hoorah on a Saturday do it Star Wars style. It's amazing. So friends, may the force be with you and I'll see you next time.